All right, welcome back. I know we've been gone for a while. It's colder than a polar bear's nipple here. So we haven't been getting out and doing much. We're in the middle of having a building built. As soon as that building's done, content will be coming fast and furious. So I'm sitting here and I'm figuring that uh, Phil Billy's birthday is coming up soon. So I decided, you know, I'll just go ahead and make him something. Because I sure as hell ain't buying his ass anything. And so I was learning about hydro dipping. I got a buddy. He makes discs for disc golf. And he dyes them. And he was telling me about hydro dipping. So I figured I'd take a, a flask that I got from Phil Billy. Because, you know, what's a better gift than a re-gift? And we'll hydro dip it for him and give it back to him. So you're going to need whatever you want to hydro dip. Make sure you clean it up good. You know, I scrub this with a Mr. Clean Eraser. Should come out pretty good. You need a bucket of cold, not super cold water. Tap cold's fine. Unless you live in Antarctica like me, then you're going to need a little warmer than tap cold. Because it comes out super cold. So you just need a bucket with some water. And you need some spray paint. Whatever you got laying around. I got four different colors. I'm just going to spray right into the water. And we're going to spray a different color. There's no rhyme or reason. Let's fill it all up. What color is this? I just grabbed some stuff out of the... That one's already empty. Got a little bit of color off of it. And you can see if you spray right in the middle, it pushes everything to the out, to the outer edges. And so you just, whatever you want, I figure pink and yellow is good for him because, you know. So he's kind of satisfying to watch. You just fill it up, whatever color. If you want to go off to the side, put your some on the side. So I want to give a shout out to a fan I come in contact with. Um, his name's Sean Rigsby. He's going to be on Master Distillers on February 23rd at 9 p.m. Make sure you watch and root him on. Hopefully he'll win. He's just a homegrown boy from here in Ohio. So February 23rd. 9 p.m. Master Distillers. Um, I think it's it's on the Discovery Channel. So watch Sean, root him on, and I'm pretty sure he's going to have a, uh, a YouTube channel coming. So when he gets that YouTube channel coming, when he gets it all set up and going, then uh, we'll go ahead and let you know his name, and you guys can check him out. So good luck, Sean. I hope you win. So we're just going to take our flask. We're just going to dip it in real slow like. And once you got it in, you want to clear away on the outside so you don't get more of it. And then... I'm going to lift it right on up out of there. Now what we're going to do is let that dry. See? Pink and yellow and white. Phil Billy's favorite colors. He's going to love this thing. I put this little wire on it so I can hang it up and let it dry. And that's all there is to it. Now you could take some protectant, spray it if you want. That way the paint don't chip off. Um, I'm not going to do that. I'm sure he's not going to use it. But he might. It matches his new Crocs that he just ordered. So... And then if you're wondering what to do with this wastewater here, 
you know, all this paint, just take you a paper towel and you'll be able to clean up this stuff off the top, skim it together, clean it off. And then once you get all that cleaned off there, that water's safe to give to your house plants. So it just cleans right out of there. So like and subscribe. Watch Moon, um, Master Distiller on Discovery, February 23rd at 9 o'clock. Root on Sean. Root on Sean. Let's hope he wins. And be on the lookout for more of our content. All right, I let this flask sit for about an hour. It's good and dry now. It came out pretty good. You know, I'm sure there's better ways of doing it. But, you know, I don't care about that. So, I figured before we give it to Phil Billy, we can't give away an empty flask. So, we'll fill it up with this uh, wheat shine that we made. Um, it's been sitting about a year in these oak chunks. And it was full when I put it in here, and that's what's left of it. So, honestly, I'm surprised there's that much left of it. So, I figured I better give him a little bit of it. It's his own fault for sending it home with me. He knew what was going to happen to it. So, let's see if we can not waste any of it. We ain't filling it all the way up. I gotta save some for myself. I mean, that's all that's left of the wheat shine. It's about three quarters of the way full. So there you go. Come back to you when I give it to him. Hope his Crocs came in, because I know they're gonna match. Oh, I got paint on the counter. On the next video, I'm going to show you how to make a sweet-ass fort on the couch because that's where I'm going to be sleeping if I don't get this paint off the counter. What the fuck you got me doing here? All right, man, I know it's your birthday, so, so I made you some. I hydro-dipped you a flask. It's cool, man. I know, it's the same color as those Crocs you ordered. <laughs> pink, huh? Yeah, and <laughs> yellow. <laughs> you gave me a pink flask for my birthday? I did. I made that, man. Don't be a dick, you ungrateful <laughs> bastard. All right, I appreciate it, dude. It's got year-old aged fucking wheat shine in it. Does it? Yeah. Hell yeah. Man, some people's children, man, they ain't grateful for nothing. <laughs> Fuck off. Let's see what you get next year. Oh, man, it's nice. Oh, now it's nice. Well, huh? you're like, I'm doing this for a feel. I'm going to fucking put pink in this motherfucker. That's cool. It's pretty. That's cool. I'll rock pink. I know you will. Pink and orange. That's cool, man. Thank you. Fuck your mama. <laughs> <laughs>